everyone, it's Leslie Bainbridge with VisitorsChoiceUSA.com. Today we're at Elevation Restaurant at the Cascade Culinary Institute in Bend, Oregon. Today we're going to have two dishes prepared for us and meet some of the wonderful staff here at the Institute. So let's go in. Today we'll meet Jean Fritz, the Executive Director of the Culinary Institute. Leslie, thank you. Welcome to the Cascade Culinary Institute and Elevation Restaurant. Our goal here at Elevation is to partner with the community to support the student learning experience. So providing great seasonal, regional, and local food as part of your dining experience during either lunch or dinner, and as well providing a great service experience. Our goal here at Cascade Culinary Institute and Elevation is to be a best in the West culinary education provider. We thank you so much for your support and patronage, and we look forward to seeing you here at Elevation Restaurant at Cascade Culinary Institute and Central Oregon Community College. Now I'd like to introduce John Nelson, the executive chef at Elevation Restaurant. He will be preparing two scrumptious dishes that include sustainable local ingredients. Thanks very much, Leslie. Yeah, today we're going to do a couple of really, really fun dishes. Uh, we're going to do one with fresh Chinook salmon. It's going to be done with tomato and a little bit of ouzo and a little bit of fennel. And then we're going to do a shrimp cocktail. It has a little bit of Korean chili on it. And it can be a really, really neat balance of uh, yin and yang, if you will. But first, got to put my hat on. All right, so we're ready. We have vinegar, about a quarter cup. Sugar, about, oh, about a tablespoon. Korean chili flakes. And I like quite a bit in there. Not too hot, just great flavor, about a tablespoon and fish sauce. Fish sauce gives it that wonderful, rich, salty balance. And from there, we have some Hungarian wax peppers. Not too hot once again, but great flavor. And then garlic and a little bit of ginger, about a teaspoon of each. And this is fun right here. This gives it a nice little hot kind of horseradishy flavor. And that is a black radish. And for the crunch, we have some sugar snap peas. And then, of course, your shrimp. We're going to mix that all up and it's going to make a beautiful, beautiful cocktail. All right, so let's do our fresh salmon, our fresh Chinook salmon. So the first thing we're going to start out with is our fennel that we've kind of shaved here about a quarter inch. And we're going to pretend that this pan is nice and hot on top of the stove. And we're going to go ahead and do about a, oh, a tablespoon, half tablespoon of garlic. And we're going to saute that up nicely. And then we're going to take our beautiful little cherry tomatoes. Now, a little trick on this. What we're going to do is we're going to just go ahead and give these guys a poke. And when they go ahead and saute, they're going to release their flavors and all their juice, and it's going to make a fantastic dish. So I'm going to go ahead and put all these guys in here. And they've all been poked. And once again, we're sauteing, we're sauteing. And then we're going to deglaze with the magic. A little bit of ouzo, porno, porno whatever you like to use. There you go. And then that's gonna kind of cook down a little bit, reduce by about a quarter. And we're gonna add some fresh squeezed tomato juice. I know fresh squeezed. Take those big old tomatoes that you really don't want to use anymore, and then just squeeze those, get the juice out of them, de-seed it. Put that in there. And let that all just simmer. And at the very, very end, we're gonna brighten the flavors with a little bit of lemon juice. And yeah, just hold my hand over the bottom of it and just catch any seeds that are going in. Just like that. And there you have it, a wonderful, wonderful citrusy, kind of a rich and sweet complement to your fresh Chinook salmon. Thanks to Jean and John at the Cascade Culinary Institute in Bend, Oregon for showing us how to make these two delicious dishes. I can't wait to eat this. Until next time, I'm Leslie Bainbridge with VisitorsChoiceUSA.com.